Okay, so here I got the GPS's. Um, so this is the uh, mount I'm going to use for tonight's bike party. It's a it's a Ram mount for uh, the E-Trex 20. I'm just going to take this little guy with me. So it's a little too big for that. Um, but yeah, so basically this one just clips right here onto my bike. So those are the mounts. Same thing with this guy. Just goes right on top like that. So let's go out for a little ride. All right, so here I am at uh, Ryland Park. It's a park near my house. Um, but uh, so here's the GPS. The Trex 20. It's this. Uh, this, this process is going to be pretty similar. Come on, focus. Okay. So uh, what you want to do is you want to go to menu. Uh, you could you can have whatever fields you want here. I'm just gonna stick with these ones. You can edit them to whatever you want. Um, I just keep it on speed, elevation, time of day, and trip odometer. So uh, what you want to do is uh, you probably want to zoom in as much as you can. So the zoom buttons are right here on the side. So this up zooms out and down zooms in. So you can see where we're at right now. We're in San Jose. And um, we're near First Street, so you wanna you wanna have it pretty pretty good zoom, especially since you're on a bicycle. Um, probably within 800 or 500 feet is good. And then what you wanna do is you wanna set your map up, set up map. So what you wanna do is you want orientation to track up. It's already on track up, and uh, and then that's it. All you have to do is, uh, and then that's it. So, so what track up does is it keeps you in the center, and the map moves around you. So, uh, and uh, I'm gonna have to show this tonight when I. But you can always uh, zoom out to get to where you're going. So you can see if I if I go down First Street here. Yeah, if I go down First Street here, I'll eventually get to the purple line that's our track so uh, so tonight I will show you how that works but I'll show you how the uh, track up works right now so here I'm, I'm riding my bicycle with my camera in my hand very dangerous <laughs> so as you can see I'm riding towards first street right now and we're heading towards first street All right so I'm gonna go ahead and do a UE right here Updates really fast. I'm pretty, it's pretty accurate. Now this has city maps on it. I don't know what maps will be on your GPS. So, so I just turn it around. See, you saw how the map rotated with me. But but my my pointer is always the same. So I can see that if I want to get on track. I have to keep on going. Uh, oh yeah, geez, there's a, <laughs> there's a there's a track on the right and the left. So I, it, basically, right now, it's saying if I make a right or a left, if I make a right or a left, uh, it'll. Uh, I don't know why there's a dude riding a motorcycle over here. But that's not legal. But uh, yeah, so if. It, if I was to go left or right, I will hit my track, is what that is. Let me go adjust the scale to like 800 feet. So you can see the freeway is right there, because the freeway is right up there. You see I just made a right turn. It's, it's turning right. to do it be even harder to do on a motorcycle so <laughs> all right so sorry about the glare so, see see the map just rotated to the right so the map rotates to you that's what you want and you want to zoom in as much as possible and then uh, during the bike party tonight I'll show you I'll show you what's up how to tell if you're where to go and like if you need to go Make a right turn or left turn. Alright, so here we go. 
I got my GPS map seven up, seven eight map hooked up to my uh, my Schwinn bike here. Uh, I'm gonna turn it turn it on. Fire it up, and I'm gonna show you how to set up the map for uh, for GPS navigation, for, just to follow tracks. <laughs> So earlier in the video, I showed you how to load the map. So that's, um, the map should have been loaded, but I'll go do it real quick. So stop. Again. Go to the tracks and then load the tracks. So okay, the tracks are loaded. So you can see they're right there. So what you want to do is set the map up. So uh, I'm trying to figure out how I do this. Uh, so on the map screen, so there's multiple pages on the GPS 78. You want to go to map right here, where I am right now. And you would want to go to menu, and then you want to set up map, and then you want to make sure your track is set up to track up, and then uh, then you want to zoom in. To about to about like uh, 800 meters or 800 feet or something, four or 500 feet. Okay, now I got I got the map set up properly. Just want to zoom in uh, as far as you think you need to zoom. Um, so I would say like. Probably, probably 500 feet will do. Uh, we can go even closer than that. We're on a bicycle, so 300 feet. So I'll give you an example of what track up does. Track up, it moves the map in the uh, it, the the map orientates around you. So let's see, so we're moving down the block right now, right? And I'm gonna make a right here on Hawthorne Street. turn see so the, the actual the, the map actually changed all right sorry the handlebars move the GPS moves with the handlebars so I'm gonna make it right here and see the map is gonna turn right but it's gonna keep me pointing out that's why they call it track up your uh, yourself just it's just point points to the north and the map orientates around you so here I'm gonna go make a I'm gonna make a left here I'm gonna try not to ha move the handlebars as much see that there so it's a little it was a little slow on the update 